it's breaking it down to the, to what they care about, how you're going to connect with them. So my partner, Adam Adams, like, as you know, the guy is an absolute genius. He coined this, the KLTI blueprint. Before they can even think about investing with you, they got to know you, right? Mm -hmm. They're not going to come across you for the very first time and say, hey, here's 500 grand. They got to know you, right? The, typically the easiest place to get known is by creating a thought leadership platform, whether that be a podcast, YouTube channel, uh, you know, an, an, an event, a meetup group, et cetera, creating the, a platform that you're the face of, that you're the host of. It's the, the quickest, easiest, best way to get known. Number yeah. two, they have to like you, right? They have to like you. Are you going to invest a hundred plus thousand dollars with a guy you don't even want to go out to dinner with? No <laughs> way. <laughs> no way. So they got to like you, right? So that's the K and the L. Now the T is the trust, Right. Do, do they trust you? Are you a trustworthy person? And then obviously flowing them into investing with you. And I bring that up specifically because when I see when and we, we coach people and help people do this all the time. But when I see people first trying to get started building their brand online, putting out content, putting out things of their life, et cetera, oftentimes they all fall into the similar trap. Real estate, real estate, real estate. Look at this deal. Look at these financing, real estate, real estate. Like if you're not sharing anything about your life, your passions, your hobbies, your goals outside of real estate, you're missing a huge audience that you otherwise would connect with. So when you are start to start going out to build your brand, build content and put, think, put yourself out into the world, understand that the no and the like and the trust comes well before the invest.